Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is Lina and I hope you guys are doing amazing. So here's a little surprise from me today. Um, so I have been away for a while and um, yeah, I needed to take care of certain things um, at a personal level and uh, I kind of feel now better. I feel not better, I would say, but yeah, I kind of feel a little different now and I feel I'm ready to roar. <laughs> so I'm back here. So this is going to be a collective reading. Um, oh, <laughs> are you kidding me? While shuffling, this was trying to pop out. The devil. Hmm. So um, when I was starting this reading, the time here was 2020. Uh, on my phone <laughs> 2020 and I saw the image of a tiger when I was switching on the video so ooh, there are a lot of things going on in my head right now let me gather my thoughts <laughs> okay let's give it a shuffle this is going to be a collective reading um, and I'm going to be posting more now. Uh, and first of all, a moment to thank everyone for being so patient with me. And uh, a big thank you to the people who checked on me while I was away. And thank you so much. I dearly appreciate your love. Thank you so much. So let's see what's the collective message. I hope you guys are doing amazing. Queen of Cups, wow, wow, there's a change here, the Six of uh, Wands at the bottom, I was about to six this, <laughs> okay, something is fucking up my words, okay, sorry for that word, um, I was about to say Six of Swords, but it was the Six of Wands, this is giving me a feeling, <clears throat> this is giving me a feeling that you thought you're going to hit a success with something in a particular way, but you're hitting the success in a little different way. Do you get my point? Like say, for example, I'm going to give you a very random example that's coming to my head right now. Say, for example, you have a portfolio of investments. So you invested into stock A, stock B, all right? And you thought that stock A is the one who is going to perform better and is going to give you more return. But it's actually stock B that gives you the more return. So I hope you're getting my point, what I'm trying to say. So there is success definitely, but a little bit different. You know, the, the it's like the, you know, <laughs> the source is a little different here. Or the way you were expecting it, it's not like that, okay? Oh my God, okay. And I'm also sensing this energy of... <clears throat> I'm seeing a lot of yellow when I'm like in my mind, the vision that I'm getting is of yellow, a lot of yellow here. So for many of you, I feel your root chakra, uh, sorry, I was about to say money for a chakra. For many of you, I feel you have been working on your uh, bottom three chakras, uh, but specifically I'm very strongly channeling the energy of your money pura chakra. For many of you, you might have recently bought a crystal or like a, pendant or something I'm getting <clears throat> I'm getting the bird Peli pelican Peli pelican I hope I'm pronouncing I'm saying that right maybe you need to go back and check the meaning like the spiritual meaning pelican I'm seeing the image, like, you know, I saw a video um, sometime back wherein, you know, the bird recovered, like it was a bird that was rescued and it recovered and it was finally able to spread its wings and fly. So I, I got the vision of that video in my head. So I'm getting this feeling that you're finally being given that. It's like you finally feel ready for something. Or you finally feel that, oh, this is what I was waiting for to happen. And now finally it's happening. I do sense some kind of 
success that comes with a change it's similar to you know like uh, the moment there's a change that you manifest and you might be a little bit quirky a little bit doubtful about it like hey i was not expecting this to happen but the moment that change happens you see success with something okay i'm getting this feeling of you know like you were supposed to go or you were supposed to you know like follow plan a but somehow you are being redirected towards plan b the moment you start with your plan b it's like huge success wow i'm also getting this uh, message of partnership so for some of you <laughs> i was about to oh my god sorry the high priestess i'm getting something related to dreams there will be a hint given to you when someone is about to enter your life okay this doesn't necessarily has to be a love relationship but i'm seeing that you're manifesting a partnership that is helping you to you know it's it's giving you that clue like hey not there you're gonna be you're you're supposed to go there so you're manifesting a partnership that is helping you to you know uh like it's it's manifesting in the form of a guidance hmm I'm getting a uh, princess of swords. I'm getting this feeling that someone like you have the right kind of eyes on you, like people who can actually give you opportunities. Um, like that's the confirmation. Um, people who can actually give you opportunities, people who can actually be your potential clients or like potential um you know like there is something regarding a potential customer client right kind of people having their eyes on you wow <gasps> king of pentacles this is what i'm talking about you don't see this offer coming because we saw the high priestess right high priestess means secret something which is happening behind the veil let's see more I hate these uh, I hate these noisy um you know I got the vision of that uh like in the game shows they do this countdown you know like three two one like you know I'm getting that I got the vision of something like that so oh wow hmm this is a beautiful feeling I have. Eight of Swords. Wow, okay. Are you serious, brother? <laughs> you have the Hierophant at the end. What am I saying? Someone is coming you to show the direction. You feel a little lost right now. Or you might be feeling a little like, mm, am I doing this? Am I doing the right thing? Or am I supposed to do this this way? Someone is going to help you innovate something, okay? Like, you feel that mm, it's like you're hitting a... When you hit like a creative block or when you, when you reach a place where you're like stuck or you feel as if, okay, now what should I do? So someone is here pitching in, coming in and giving you that, okay, let's do it like this. I'm getting this... Um, wow i can't believe i'm getting the reference of this so there's this guy okay on youtube he makes videos on like mindset and stuff like that so i remember and this is i'm talking uh, i i on and off watch him sometimes because i like the way he delivers his uh, you know thoughts so i remember he i watched one of his video like a couple of months back last year i think it's been eight nine months now and he was referring to, you know, like um, he was actually giving an example to explain a concept. And in that example, he said that, you know, uh, my YouTube channel came to a halt. It was not growing when it came to like I was not getting many views and it kind of came at a standstill. OK, like I was not able to go beyond those number of views or subscribers. Then suddenly uh, universe shakes things in his life. 
so someone from his creative team actually uh quit the job okay like someone who was a major part of their team so that person quits the job and he's like oh my god i'm already feeling stuck i'm already feeling in a mess and now this guy is leaving but accidentally or coincidentally he ended up hiring someone new completely like you know a person whom he would usually not hire a little bit different from what he would choose but the moment that guy enters his team and he gives him some revolutionary ideas like hey why don't you do this like this it's gonna attract more viewers it's gonna you know like things like that and he kind of followed it followed his intuition with that guy and when he followed his intuition and he was like okay i'll let you do how you want to do i will follow you okay fine we can try this we can experiment and the when the moment he does that uh, does that in a couple of weeks he starts getting more view and act I, this is a proof because i have been following that guy on and off for a couple of years now like 2 3 years and even i noticed then that in the last when i watched that video his views were actually at a very high end you know like he was suddenly going viral and stuff like that so like i was suddenly got reference of that video that i watched okay so i'm getting this feeling like something is going to happen the example like there's a reason i explained the whole story here because i feel this is something what is going to happen with you as well okay something you were planning in a certain way you will be redirected you will be you will be literally the way you were trying to execute there could be a change in that there could be a tower moment in that execution but this is the ultimate nail in the coffin where you'll be like okay this was it you know so that's the kind of feeling i'm channeling i'm also channeling number 6 a lot for you guys 6 and 2 is something which i keep channeling oh my god <gasps> this was literally flying like it jumped out of the deck okay and it was like ooh, ooh, ooh. it came out like that okay oh my god i hope i didn't spoil my card i love my cards man <laughs> i i keep them very nicely 10 of pentacles like look at that what am i saying wow so right now if something is not going your way and you are kind of being forced to make certain changes or you are being like what the hell do you do i keep I keep seeing this high priestess and not just today but in the last couple of days whenever I'm trying to pull cards I see this card okay I think many of you you need to pay attention to your dreams okay you will be sh you are giving you are being given certain kind of hints in your dreams so pay attention you're manifesting and you look okay look the card that was trying to pop out was 6 of pentacles this is exactly what i'm talking about wow number 6 is very significant we will take only one more card and let's see i'm not going to keep this reading too long um i'll soon do a pick a card or a pick a pile or maybe pick a coffee cup something i'm going to soon do another one uh Okay, let's see what is that oh my god look at that the star card wow and bottom you have seven of pentacles yeah something you have been working for a while on now it's your time to hit that big nail in the coffin oh my god something is unique here i'm getting like you are discovering your unique style when i saw this card because star also represents popularity right it it represents a lot of things but it also does represent you being in the spotlight you are the popular one and things like that so i'm getting a feeling that you are discovering a unique style of yours it's like and you are not being shy there is a reason why i was channeling this manipura chakra uh, energy so strongly in the beginning because manipura chakra is all about your confidence it's all about your um self worth and is self esteem wow i hate when this happens and and trust me it was it was so quiet when i started the reading 
I mean, when I decided to do the reading, but uh, now it's... Okay, let me grab this card. All right. Oh my God, you got the best, you got the best of two suits. Look at that. Ten of cups that fell down and ten of pentacles that came out a little bit earlier. Oh my God. <laughs> this is amazing. I'm going to leave the reading here. It's an amazing, amazing um, end to the reading. I'm going to leave it here. Thank you so much guys for joining me. Thank you so much once again for being so patient with me. And I always appreciate your love and support on my channel. Uh, I'm going to post more readings. So stay tuned. Turn on your notification bells. Uh, you'll be notified when I post another video. And thank you once again for staying with me till the end. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.